sports, 100% reflected. Sometimes it's Raven. Sometimes it's other teams affected. Hold on tight, strap in. It's gonna get hectic. Couch Rider Report, an original sports perspective. Hey, hey, welcome back to the home of original sports perspective. From our couch to yours, this is your host, Jermaine Locke, and the Couch Rider Raven. Let's get it, let's go. If this is your first time here, I appreciate you. Go ahead and we're going to pass that collection plate. Please hit the like button, hit the subscribe, and smack that bell so you know when it's going down. For those of you who came back, the loyal Couch Rider Raven Nation, appreciate you. Thank you for tuning in for another episode. Just make sure you hit that like button, please. Let's get it, let's go. So you saw the title. Who's going to break out on week one against the Las Vegas Raiders in Vegas for their inaugural home game? Well, it's going to be a guy who only had nine total sacks throughout his college career. Played for Notre Dame, had a history of shoulder injuries, and he never had more than three sacks in one season. You're like, why would you sell all this like that? Oh, okay, okay, yes. Because there's so many other good things. I need to get the bad things out of the way. Because this guy's name is Dalen Hayes. Dalen Hayes, folks, will be the breakout star for the Baltimore Ravens against the Las Vegas Raiders on Monday Night Football. You're like, why? Well, you can see the tape during the preseason. He's just getting off the edge. There's a guy on Twitter. I believe his name is called The Haitian Nation. <laughs> He shows a clip where Dalen is getting off the edge. He said, Dalen is crazy underrated. He just dips and goes. And he's telling, he's just saying, look at the tape. It is phenomenal. The guy does have crazy dip. I love what this dude does for the team here. And let's just talk about some of the things he did in college. Now he had two forced fumbles and two sacks in the same game where Notre Dame ended up beating Georgia. And they put it, the offense ended up putting up 31 points to 13. And then because of his leadership, they put him as a captain, as a senior for the team. So it's pretty cool. And that year he helped raise them in defensive categories by 20 spots in multiple categories, namely third down conversions, interceptions, sacks, forced fumbles, pass defenses, you name it, they went up in their rankings because of the leadership of Dalen Hayes. Very impressed with the guy. So not only can he put his hand in the ground and pass rush, he can also defend the pass. But he's such a great team player, has a great spirit about him. He's bragging about his teammates already. He says Bowser is one of the best pass defense linebackers that he's ever come across. I'm loving it. He's using Bowser as a mentor. And he's using Justin Houston as a mentor. Justin Houston is getting his handwork together, teaching him a couple other pass rush moves. I am loving it. And I will love it even more if he faces off against rookie Alex Leatherwood because his profile review wasn't as glaring as everybody thinks should be out of the guy so big. So let's talk about it. Alex Leatherwood looks like he might be the target to take advantage of on Monday night because while this guy is 6'5", 312 pounds, he's still a rookie. His reviews say he doesn't have strong hands. He's missing knockback power and he's missing that initial burst on contact when it comes to being a, a right tackle. So if Dalen comes over there and he's got that quick burst and quick dip and just dips and goes, I'm seeing a big night. Seeing a big night for the the former ACC honorable mention, the former defensive lineman of the week because of those two sacks and two fumbles caused in one game. Yes, those sacks end up causing those fumbles, but who gets two sacks and two fumbles in one game in college? Especially when you only had nine sacks on the season. So he had some he had some highs and he's had some lows. But for his ability to be able to defend the pass. His ability to be able to, pat, or to just have that burst and get off the line and be able to dip low and just go get it. He just goes and gets it. He's going to eat on Monday night. And I'm telling you, breakout game. And I mean by breakout game, I'm talking reasonable. I'm not going to go off the charts and be like, yo, he's going to get like three sacks. No, I'm going to give you legit numbers. He's going to have five tackles. Three of those are going to be solo. I give him one pass defense and a sack. Good numbers, right? Okay, I think so. So that's Dalen Hayes in a nutshell, folks. Trust me, guy's gonna blow up. 
This is the home of original sports perspective from our couch to yours. Thanks for tuning in. This is your Couch Rider Raven saying two claps, fade to black.